Hello everybody and welcome back to Jade Empire where we are the bronze division champion in the arena and now we need to keep working our way up. Approaches. I hope you're ready for the challenge awaiting you in the silver division. Remember, soldier's the champion at this level. He'll be watching you. I'm sure he will. Dogs nipping at my heels aren't worthy of watching. Yeah, definitely. What do you need? I'm ready for my next fight. Now that you are champion of the bronze division, the silver division awaits. It seems that, indirectly, this serpent has decided to keep your career interesting. A demon has been added to the regular roster since your earlier victory. And since you've shown aptitude, I'm letting you face him first. Okay. This is indeed an honor, though it will not be easy. Are you ready to defeat this horror? Yes, indeed. Horse demon will will do Excellent. the job. Follow me and we'll get you ready for your next match. Is this another toad demon? What type of demon is this? Will the demon rend flesh from bone or will a lone warrior Elephant prove demon. stronger? Okay. That's going to be interesting. Okay. Get off, you elephant demon. Holy crap. Okay. So, the frontal assault on the elephant demon ain't going to work. <laughs> okay. Now. Yep, let's do this. So it's an elephant demon. Will We've fought demon one of these before. From bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? The trick to the elephant demon. Well, double let's see if let's see if the double sabers style works on it. Okay, yep. Yeah, he's gonna just do that nonsense. And then he's just gonna do that nonsense if we go in. Okay. When we did the, when we did this before, we had Dawnstar helping us. Okay, that doesn't affect him. And he does not recoil at all either. We got a little bit of damage down there. He is immune to all of our styles pretty much. Okay. So the thing I'm wondering is, can we block his abilities? Yes, we can. Okay. Looks like we can block most of his abilities. Yep. Okay. So that's intriguing, to be sure. We can block that ability, too. Of course, we can't block his power attack, which that was the first time he used it, so I was not expecting a power attack there. Okay. So this is intriguing. Oof. Okay. Okay, so his attacks have very little time between them. So we need something fast. However, we can block almost every attack that he has. So let's go ahead and keep doing what we were doing there towards the end. And with a full chi bar, we should be able to do this. Bone, or will a lone warrior prove stronger? These demons are tough, though. Okay, come here, demon. Oop. Did not have time to get out. Oh, did not even have time to get up there. That was rude. Okay. I need healing. Cannot jump backwards from his power attack. Interesting. So there's simply no time to jump backwards from his power attack, and he hit us twice there, one before I could even get once before I could even get up. Which just isn't fair. <laughs> okay. This is largely happening because we don't have any points in this style. Also, I suck at fighting demons. Stronger? 
Okay. And he immediately does his power attack twice. Thanks, bro. <laughs> what a jerk. Okay. Come on in. If we had a ranged style that we could use on this guy, that would be useful. We do have access to Toad Demon, but I don't think that's particularly handy. He's immune to Ice Shard. He's immune to Storm Dragon. I think we just need to be doing this number, except we can't really block. Like, there's no animation canceling in this game. That's the core issue that I'm running into on these demons, is that you can't animation cancel. So, like, once you're swinging, you can't start blocking until after your swing is done. Yep, I'm trying to demonstrate things, demon. Go away. Sheesh, what a jerk. We can't spirit thief, so our chi is what it is. So, I mean, this attempt is pretty much, pretty much donezo. But uh, we can do this, and then we can block all of his attacks. But unfortunately, we can't really damage him back. We can't jump backwards from, from that particular attack. We have to go sideways. And we cannot go to the left either, apparently. You have to go right. Gotcha. The other thing is, of course, we can uh, we can always go horse demon once we whittle him down a little bit. Will the demon rend flesh from bone, or will a horse demons? Hang on a moment. Stronger? Horse demons can cast fire, can't they? How do they do that? Is that in chi strike mode? Let's see. I'm not entirely sure. Let's give it a go. Okay. So you've got that. Okay. Ah. I gotcha. Okay. Look at that. I figured out how to do that casting. Excellent. <laughs> so, horse demon against demons. I got this. I now know how to do the casting for horse Another demon. demon so. falls. We shall have to add a new division for you alone if this keeps up. Yeah, demons won't Kylon be a problem Serpent anymore. Wishes to speak with you personally. This is a rare honor. Do try to be polite. Yeah, probably not going to happen. You've already been granted access to the back room of the arena, and the serpent's private chamber is just off of it. You may as well go now and see what he wants. Oh, and one other thing. The Serpent has requested that you visitate him alone. I know you usually have a friend with you, but they'll have to remain behind for this meeting. Now I really don't trust him. What does he have against Dawnstar? Before we go in there, uh, let's actually come over here and make the rounds. This is going to minimize the game if I don't pause it. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. She doesn't have anything new to say. Soldier. Looks like you're still walking after that last match. Too bad. You just watch yourself. We will be sending you to see me if you keep that up. And I'll break you in two. <laughs> yeah, good luck. Talk to you later. Go bother someone else. First demon just does so much damage, it's insane. I watched your last match. I'm sure you did. I bet Soldier's got his eye on you. He'll be nervous about how quickly you're advancing. Keep him off balance. That's the idea. And what about you guys? Look who stands before us, brothers. Why, it's the reason for soldiers' increased surliness. Congratulations on managing the impossible. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't have believed that he could be more surly either. Okay, let's go talk to the serpent dude. We should have told you that Kylan will only see you alone. Are you ready to go in now? Yeah, but what does he have against Dawnstar? I'll wait out front with the others if you need me. Be careful. I don't trust this situation at all. Neither do I.
It is vital that we talk a moment. Your inability to deal with the minor demon cost me dearly. I expected more from you, but I'm prepared to overlook your weakness for the moment. I mean, I fixed that problem. I know how to deal you with demons now. You are a smart young woman. Smart enough to know that you will get much further as my friend than my foe. You may find that certain opportunities, mutually rewarding arrangements between us, will come your way in the near future. If you're proposing I cheat or throw fights, I refuse. Cheat is such a pedestrian term. I prefer to think of myself as a creative engineer. Like the fountains that channel water throughout the land, I spread entertainment to the people. Right now is an interesting time for an organization known as the Guild. I've no doubt that Kui has told you about us, if you didn't already know. Yeah, I have no interest. Our organization is involved in many different activities, most of which operate below the view of the authorities of this great empire. Why are you telling me this? You're a bunch of criminals. Come now. We're above calling each other names, aren't we? It's not a name. A name would be the like Guild, if I called you Fred. The has recently developed a vacancy in its upper echelons. A man by the name of Gao the Greater has been killed, and with his death, a new leader must be chosen. Really? Gao was killed? Who could have done that? I intend to replace him in that role, and I need good people to back me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You realize that I'm the one who eliminated Gao the Greater. Did you? An interesting claim. And one I'm not sure I believe. You don't match the description we have of the killer. But then, the descriptions are fairly tenuous. If you are the one who killed Gao, then I owe you a favor. Consider my reluctance to turn you into the Lotus Assassins a repayment for that debt in full. No, please, turn me in. There is the matter, however, of your friend, Whirlwind. I'm sure you know that he was one of the fighters here and that he left the arena. But do you know why? It was probably because you cheated or something. Um, let's see here. I don't really care. He's useful, that's all that's important. Useful, but dangerous. Sure, but that's the most useful kind of useful. Whirlwind's past is certainly a colorful one. Did he tell you that he was thrown out of the arena? Not surprised. Public displays of rage and drunkenness, uttered threats of murder, excessive violence, property damage, and I believe several charges of defecating in public. Sounds like him. Nothing I don't already know. I can accept him as he is. If you trust him, you are a fool. The Black Whirlwind is an impressive fighter, but he is better avoided than confronted. Didn't say I trust him. We couldn't let him fight as he was, so he left. His brother, Raging Ox, wisely stayed here and went on to become champion. You could reach that point yourself, you know. Indeed, that's a distinct possibility. To become champion yourself, you will need my support. That means you and I will work together closely. Yeah... I want nothing to do with you, Serpent. You place yourself in a precarious position, my young friend. I would hate to see your career stagnate. You see... What is that noise? Hey, you can't... <laughs> Damn you, serpent! I'll kill you where you stand! No, you won't, whirlwind. Just like last time, you will leave. I can see that this polite discussion has concluded, as so many do, in your odorous presence. We may talk again. 
Perhaps. Hopefully not. We're leaving now. You and I have to talk alone. It's important. Okay then. Well, one of these guys is a drunken lout, and one is just really skeevy. Look, you can't trust Kylon. I know he was probably offering you the world, or maybe all the wine in it if he were really crafty, but... You didn't honestly think you were going to slip down here after that little display, did you, Whirlwind? Step back, Cho. For once in my life, I've got something important to tell someone. You have nothing important to say, you lummox. You embarrass Kylon the Serpent, and I'm going to make sure you never get a chance to repeat your performance. Good luck. I've been waiting for this. Time to cut off the Serpent's tail! Oh boy. Ugh. These don't do nearly as much damage as I would have liked, but it's fine. <laughs> okay. That's quite enough. You kill him, I'll keep him stunned, Black Whirlwind. Sound good? <laughs> You got this. Are, are you hitting him, Black Whirlwind? I'm not convinced you're actually hitting him. Okay, maybe he just has a million hit points. Yeah, I think he just has a million hit points. Black Whirlwind is in fact hitting him. I mean, I don't know why he thought this was going to end in, in any way differently. This is, uh, this is a little stupid, though. Okay, let's just end this. <laughs> That's quite enough. Get out of here. That's quite enough leaping around. He fought like a monster for a little guy. Yeah, stunlocked monster, maybe. Are you all right? Better than I've been in a while. All this best behavior when you're in the city business was wearing on my nerves. Not the first time I've gone up against one of Kai Lon's thugs, you know. Not at all. I'm not surprised. That's unfair. These axes don't sharpen themselves, you know. <laughs> Remember I told you I used to fight in the arena? Well, I was the best there was. Then my brother came to the city and decided he joined the arena too. The arena was about the same as it is now. Kui and Kai Lan were there and Lucky Cho too, but he was just a runt back then. Is your brother still fighting? My brother became the arena champion, the Raging Ox. They said he retired, but he didn't retire. He was killed. I should know. I'm the one who killed him. Why did you kill him? Raging Ox was one of Kylon's men. Well, he wasn't always. Kylon approached me first. And when I turned him down, he went to my brother instead. When Ox joined up with Kylon, I stopped getting good matches. Ox was fighting his way to becoming champion and doing a little work for the guild on the side. Now that must have made things awkward between you two. He was so cocksure and wouldn't listen to his older brother. Once he fell in with Kylon, he stopped talking to me. Soon Ox became Kylon's enforcer and carried out his bidding. He'd skulk around in robes so no one would know the arena champion was a common thug. One night I followed Ox back to Kylon's. I was drunk and I was mad. I just wanted to tell Ox how dangerous Kylon was, convince him to leave. But Kylon was there. He tried to interfere. I attacked him, and Ox tried to stop me. When it was over, Ox was dead, 
and my axe was covered in his blood. What happened then? Kailan just stood there, smiling. I would have killed him if I wasn't so stunned. After that, I left. For the first time in my life, I ran. I ran, and then I drank myself into a stupor that lasted for half a year. Kailan truly is a serpent. You do what you have to in the arena. Just don't fool yourself about working with a serpent. Wasn't planning on working with him. Lucky Cho's death just put you on the serpent's wanted list. I'd really like to see Kylon's face if you become arena champion. Of course, I'd rather just kill him. Come on, let's go. Yes, indeed. Let's. Okay, so, um, we need to work our, keep working our way up in the arena, and, uh, yeah. That's pretty much all we need to do. We apparently have Black Whirlwind now. Uh, I would much prefer if we have some that you have fight me. that we need. I'd much prefer to have Dawnstar. She is useful after all. Okay. Uh, we need to talk to these guys, looks like, according to the map marker. You would speak again with the Sung Brothers? How fascinating that we have earned so much of your attention. I need to know about the Black Whirlwind and Kylon. Your expansive friend returns on a dark fall of the cards, I'm afraid. His story, like all stories where brothers fall out, is not lightly told. Why did the Black Whirlwind leave? The Black Whirlwind and Raging Ox had a confrontation. No one really knows what happened, but suffice it to say Ox remained here. Raging Ox continued to rise through the ranks to become champion, while your friend left his brother and the arena behind. Perhaps you should ask the Black Whirlwind yourself. Yeah, yeah, maybe I should. How do you think Kylon will react to the Black Whirlwind's return? Has there not already been a reaction of sorts? Kylon likely wants nothing more than his ex-star fighter to leave this place. Of course, that means he wants the same of you. Mm, good luck. The Black Whirlwind was never one to follow rules, and Kylon is one who demands that his rules be followed. Indeed. That's all I need. Oh yes, we shall see you around. Of that you can be sure. Okay. Han, what do you have to say? Hello again. It's a lovely day, isn't it? My bruises are healing nicely, and I really couldn't be happier. You have something on your mind? I need to know some things about Black Whirlwind's time at the arena. This is about your friend and the Serpent, right? It would probably be better to ask some of the higher division fighters. I didn't hear much about it. I do remember Raging Ox. He was always full of life and he had fun in the ring. He was a much better champion than the Ravager. Okay then. That's all I need from you. Right you are. Take care. Soldier. What do you want now? Nothing, apparently. Lily? Nothing, apparently. Okay. Well, I guess it's time to talk to Kui and get ourselves another fight. I want to hear that you're ready for your next fight. Indeed I am. What do you need? I, I, I'm ready for my next fight. Actually, let's talk some more about Black Whirlwind's history here. More than I'd care to. I strongly suspect that Lucky Cho's disappearance was no coincidence. You think? I wondered when things would come to a head. I was hoping Black Whirlwind would just stay away, but he won't, will he? Not while you're here. Indeed. Black Whirlwind says Raging Ox is actually dead. Do you believe that? I wondered. It seemed too convenient that he'd one day just suddenly leave and never return, with only a letter to tell us he was going. I figured that if Raging Ox had been killed, only one person I could think of possessed the skills to do it. His brother. For his sake, I kept my peace. Makes sense. The last thing he needs is accusations of murder. He's already filled a dozen scrolls with records of public drunkenness, crimes against decency, and violence. 
Now, let's not speak of this again. If you must speak of it, talk to your friend directly. Not sure I'd call him friend, but I get your point. Tell me about my next fight. This next fight should be fairly simple for you. I once more want to send you up against four opponents. The crowd loves those fights. These are tougher than the students you faced before, but should pose no problem. Are you ready to get started? Four opponents, huh? Yes, I am. However, it's that time once again. So I'm going to go ahead and put a cut in here. And next episode, we will continue our rise through the arena. See you all then.